Are we gonna shoot birds this morning? We are gonna shoot birds this morning. We got some nasty weather. It's not looking pretty as far as weather, but we'll brave it out and we'll shoot some birds. It's gonna be greasy. Shoot him! Got him! Hey, I got one, boys. The single shot is clapping, dude. <laughs> Kill him. Get him! Get him! Get him! Oh my god, dude! Dude, this, this guy is so dead! Oh my god, dude! Post interview? I told you it was gonna be greasy. Yeah, that was Matt! Got me another one. <laughs> Holy crap. January 13th, end of the season. <sighs> wow, he's got a lot of mass. Oh, look at those giant feet. This is the buck. It's not the 10 pointer I thought it was, but this is the buck that was leaving the tracks. I got him. Oh, that's a massive buck. Look at that. Nice. But it's obviously an old buck going downhill. Look at this mass out here. Yep. I mean, this is as big as my wrist in here. Yeah. It's just so cool to get this done at the end here. We got it. January. I know. Well, I've given him about, uh, you know, 30 minutes or so, 35, 40 minutes, and uh, I'm going to go over here and, and take a look.
Let's see what we got. Oh, yes. <laughs> 2012 Bobuck right here. He is nice buck. Old mature deer. Definitely a fighter. Definitely one that we want to take. We got uh, some good trail camera photos of this guy. Just right down here in the corner. Man. Sure does pay off to really, really do a lot of scouting and just do a lot of work putting into into the ground and you know knowing it for <laughs> for quite a few years here now and man, just looking at this deer this is just spectacular. Keep in mind guys, this was not warm. <laughs> it was not warm out here. But this bull came in um, basically out of this tall timber into this mountains here. And uh, you can kind of see him. It was, it was really hard to see because the camera I had wasn't made for this. But there you can see him. Um, he's walking out. He looks tiny from here, but um, it was a very big, you know, it was the biggest animal I, I've ever seen. So basically it got close enough. Um, I just had Gino, my buddy, hold the camera behind me as I shot um, because I didn't have the proper shooting lens for this type of application you can't really see the elk here in this in this picture um, but basically all I am is up on a giant ridge top looking down at this and I, I'm about to take this shot so I was just, I was so like freaking out, shaky that I just, I was like losing it. <laughs> We did it, Gino. Right, <laughs> we did it. All right. Wow. Beautiful animal. They sure are gorgeous.
Yeah, baby. But that Tom is down. Let's go. Guys, that happened so fast. Oh, you betcha. Yes! Got him done. Oh my God. All right guys, it's the third day of fourth season here in Illinois and we got it done today. <laughs> And uh, yeah, we came up here, made it happen. Me being a pretty novice turkey hunter, like I said, obviously I've kind of only done this. This is only like my second year doing this now. I try to lay off the call a little bit um, just because I know I might not sound exactly like a turkey and uh, that could spook birds away, but I'm